All right, we're at Target. We're going to test out Target's makeup section, which I have better hopes for than Walmart because I know they have ColourPop and Wick Winky Lux, but I was actually really surprised by Walmart's makeup selection. They had like the normal brands, of course, like Revlon and Maybelline and CoverGirl, but like they also had those really cute nails. I think that's really what I was focused on, was how cute those nails were at yeah. Walmart. And then, cute. but I, I definitely like the nails you picked. At Ulta? Yeah. Or the one at Walmart? I'll show you guys later. We have better lighting, we'll show you. Yeah. I'll apply them. No, we'll go. Or scrap look. Color pop. Oh. Right here. Right here, right now. My favorite. Yeah, so you're highlighting the high points of your cheeks and you're bronzing the low points. Got it. I learned those terms now. What was your question? How do you choose your color to highlight? Oh, generally you want a lighter color. So you want like a tan or a shiny, shiny tan color and then for bronzer you'd want more of a brown color more of a matte brown so why would these highlight have so different color like purple or red or because white? some people like have you ever seen like rave core stuff like makeup for raves and stuff oh kind of yeah so it's really more, cool uh, so it'd be like for special fashion occasions. yeah it's like for fashion like this purple one right here mm -hmm. I'd use that as an eyeshadow. I don't know what else you could really use it for, but I'm sure there are some cool people who could use it like other places. But this like pink one, pretty sure you can use that as a blush if you wanted. Pretty cool. I'm sure. But yeah, it says shock shadow. So I don't know if it just means it's an eyeshadow. Mm -hmm. So trying to basically trying to choose something that's close to the color of your face? Um or like the color of your cheeks, I guess. Mm. Ooh, what's this? LA Girl? $13 for a palette of what is that? 20, 20 something? 24 maybe? 25. Yeah, that this... olive color could be really interesting. Yeah, I like. Not a fan of the brown one. What do you like? I think in general. More color palette wise, I like this one better. Yeah. For certain ones, I do like like this one. Yeah. Or this one, this one, maybe the gold sparkly. Yeah, I think so, I like this one the most so yeah. far. Yeah. What about London? I hit something. Ooh, that one looks crazy. Yeah. Yeah, this dark blue would be cool, but it'd be really hard to highlight it and show it off. Mm -hmm. But I like the Miami color. Than Miami! Interesting. Yeah, very cute. And the super disappointing nail section of Target. Oh. They have French tips, they have some stickies. Ooh. Got more Galaxy Kit. Look, they got more Galaxy Kittens. Ooh. Yeah, those are my favorite. Winky Lux. Winky Lux. Yeah, because look at the colors. Yeah, me too. There's so many perfect colors. Like, one day I'll buy that palette, but not until I've used more colors of my other palettes. And then I could never buy one of these because holy moly. I use those. I don't know because they're really cute and beautiful and I would never want to use it. Cream brush. Cream brush? Cream blush. Cream blush. Ooh. Wonder Direction. Easily it. blend onto cheeks with finger or brush. Huh. Oh, I just use dip it in, I guess. And look, they have. Amethyst balm. 
they have the pH bomb. If you see anything you think is interesting, you want me to explain it to you? Because a lot of this shit is just them like throwing shit together and saying it's an, it's beauty. I'm interested to know what all these uh, makeup products, what they exactly going to do. Yeah. Because they, look, like they make their own things up, like Bronze Age. Like this is a bronzer. I can tell just because it says bronze, but, or the Cheeky Rose, I can only assume it's the, the blush because cheeks. Mm -hmm. Like okay. they make up their own names for everything. What's okay. the difference between the term like eyeshadow and eye eyeliner? Okay, so eyeliner is a pencil, and okay. it's the way you apply it. So you're applying it with a pencil versus eyeshadow, which is a powder, where you're applying it with a brush. So it's kind of thinking of it like charcoal drawing versus painting, like with a, a brush. With a brush, it's okay. like different mediums of color. Okay. So you apply it different, so it appears different slightly. How did you apply your red? Oh, with a brush. With a brush. One of my cheap $10 Amazon brushes. I don't even know what the brand name is. Something Asian. This reminded me of the story I finished telling. Yeah? When my uh, mom first started drawing again. Okay. She didn't have any brushes, so she took my sister's makeup brush. <gasps> <laughs> I mean... You gotta do what you gotta do. Oh, that's close enough. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna go to uh, Michael's. He looks some uh, crafting products. For a scrapbook. Yes. And for uh, Autumn's website, too. So there's Target. See you guys at Michael's. Alright, we're here at Michael's. That's right. I see some crafting supplies here. Oh. Double ended watercolor brush pens. This is the one you're talking about? Yeah. So that's a brush on one end, like a painting <clears throat> brush, mm -hmm. and it has the ink come out. So it's like more of a fluid movement. Okay. And then it has the fine tip. Never tried those before. Yeah. I don't know. We'll try that. You wanna? Yeah, let's try it. Okay. Did you find the frame you're looking for? What size are I'm you trying, looking? I'm trying to look for a uh, frame for one of our photos. Oh. I think either. Ooh. Dark red. I like that. It depends on the photo, to be honest. Or just with. Five by five. I'll make it four by four. Oh, because it's. I'm gonna. I'm keep the yeah, border. Yeah, you're gonna keep the border. Okay. Ooh, I love that. That's adorable. Yes. Yeah, I'm gonna get this one. Okay. Where are you gonna put it? You know, I won't get something out of my computer desk. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Got a full frame. A square one. And I don't know if Autumn showed you, we got some uh, watercolor pencil too. Can't wait to try those. Yeah. It's gonna be really fun. They have squishies, but they're not cute. <laughs> Let me try it right here too. Mm -mm. No? Mm -mm. Not like this? Mm -mm. I'd apply it to Sephora or Ulta or Lululemon. I'd apply somewhere that I'd spend the employee discount like hard. Mm. I don't know what Lululemon's employee discount is, but it's got to be good because every single employee wears a Lululemon in there. It's like a uniform. I mean, in the beginning, though, you'd be like, all right, here's your uh, set amount of money. Just get anything in the store or present it. That would be so awesome. I would totally work for Lulu. If they have a Lulu here, they should have it. If they did, I would apply for it. Yeah. All right, it's time to get our key. Okay, go back to my place, get the key, go to Walmart. We're Come good. Back. Relax the rest of the day. Yes. We are now going home. I will see you guys soon. Bye bye.